this beach is the third best beach in the whole Bali. Today we're gonna do acro yoga and show you around a bit. This is episode 7. Enjoy! Today there are a couple of bikes I can uh, choose from. I can choose this bike, this bike, this bike. But today I'm gonna go on my bike, which is this bike. It's a little bit old, a little bit rusty, but it works just fine. Okay, I guess today is not the day to take my bike out. So, we have no other option. We have why we took my wife's bike it's actually faster but it's automatic so it's less fun in my opinion <laughs> but the bike works and now we're at Sanur Beach we're not here to talk about bikes we are here to do the yoga what kind of yoga is it acro. we're here to do the acro yoga so it works like this it's like two people doing the yoga so my wife is gonna be laying down on the sand and she's gonna lift me with her legs <laughs> No, wrong! No, I'm wrong? That's wrong, <laughs> Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, I was wrong. But uh, that's what we're gonna do here. And this beach is ranked number three on our list. It means that most people who come to Bali think highly of this place. And there's a good reason for it. Sanur is the opposite of Kuta. Geographically and socially. It means there are no clubs, no waves, no surfers, and it's less hectic and more relaxing. It's perfect beach for all people and families with kids. Or simply anybody who loves calm ocean and amazing sunrises. Taking a morning stroll or chilling by the pool. Even if chilling is not the reason you decided to visit Bali, I would still recommend a trip to Sanur at least once in the morning. It's amazing here. We're actually a little bit unlucky because right now it's uh, rain season. There are clouds which make this beach not as attractive as, as it usually is. And we didn't come here in the morning. So this is how it looks like in rain season. But the good thing is we forgot the sunscreen. So having clouds is actually a good thing for us. <laughs> yeah. Here. Yeah, for me. <laughs> She's fine, just for me. There's also a path. This path is actually really useful. There's so many restaurants here. There's lots of people in the morning who walk here or run or take the bicycle tours. This beach is actually a morning beach for morning people. And we're not morning people. <laughs> so we came here around like eight. There are still lots of people here. But if you really want to see good sunrises, come here in the morning. This beach is quite famous 
and it means that you probably have to share it with other people. Go for a place away from Sanur port to avoid massive crowds of people. It gets hectic here in the morning when people are queuing for a trip to Nusa Penida or Nusa Lembongan. There are a lot of tourists here, but there is still a chance to find a place away from crowds. This stretch of shore is around 5 kilometers long. There should be plenty of space for everybody. And sometimes people tend to stay close to their hotels or in larger groups. Saya, so, yeah, look at those people. There are lots of people there. And nobody here. Except us, we're here. We forgot to bring the water with us. So we need to go to some of the water rooms up here and buy water. Uh, the thing is, this is a touristy place. <laughs> so the water is normally costing like 7,000 for like one and a half liter. But if you can find it for like 10,000, it's okay. So we're gonna go on an expedition and find water for 10,000. See if it's possible or not. <laughs> we're gonna try to haggle if, uh, if they say the price is more than 10,000. Yeah. Water? Yeah, how much is this one? Fifth? Yeah. Fifteen. Fifteen thousand. How many? Two by uh, ten thousand. <laughs> can I get one for ten? Okay, okay, yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I'm a yeah. Yay, we, we got the water. <laughs> it's so easy. <laughs> yeah, he said it cost 15,000, but we know it's supposed to cost like around 10. So he was a nice guy, he said it's 10. Some other people know, they're like, they go, they say to you 30 or 20, and then you can uh, haggle down to like 20 or 15. <laughs> but these guys at the entrance, they were nice. It's a tutorial to drink water on the beach. Yeah. Right. <laughs> like that, yeah. yeah. Dang, it looks so cool, though. Uh, really? Look. Oh, yeah. It looks kind of cool, yeah. Yeah. The first time we tried it was also fun. She fell on her head. This is the second time and we watched some videos, but we still have no idea what we're doing. So, <laughs> if, <laughs> if you're doing this a lot, don't laugh at us. <laughs> no, we do whatever we think it's fun for us. Yeah, we... I don't care what it's called. <laughs> yeah, we do like Superman, Hakuna Man, <laughs> Sanur Beach Man, <laughs> Fat Man. <laughs> Fat Man. <laughs> <laughs> Sambong. 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 It's starting. <laughs> We're in a way. Oh no, we're not. Yeah, we're in a way. <laughs> For bicycles. Wait, what episode is it? Like in seven, eight? Yeah, seven. Okay, and verse three on our list. I think I spit in the lens and we're talking. Yeah, rain, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay, my oh, face. Okay. Uh, uh, yeah, recording. Sayang, I'm still overexposed. How come? 